remember like 25 years ago, clear as a bell, but no clue about like 10 hours ago? <laughs> every lyric of every song yes. in the 80s? Yes. Yes, yes, I can. Uh, David Venable and I break out into song in the host lounge all the time. I love it. And then I don't know what I did earlier I today. Know. I have song running through my head right now. Oh, boy. Uh-oh. You'll be back. It's from Hamilton. Oh, I haven't. The King sings it. I have hilarious. Seen. I haven't seen Hamilton yet. <laughs> we should get a group trip together. And we should go dressed in great fall tops. Because this is my favorite season. I love that you guys celebrate this. And I know Jean loved fall and Jean loved Halloween. Mm -hmm. And I think this is such a great way to continue. Absolutely. Her love of it and her legacy. I mean, this is a great top to wear, actually, to Thanksgiving. 8292691. We're calling it the Autumn Harvest French Terry Tunic, 60 cotton, 40 poly, 29 and a half to 33 and three quarters, so tunic alert. 4775, six easy payments of less than $8 expire end of day. Espresso corn. Yeah. Seeming detail cardinal. Beautiful. Oh, Look at the, that. The, the seams on the pumpkins, little hint of sparkle, leaves, apples, acorns, oh my, calico corn. Really mm. fabulous. Have you picked up pumpkins yet this season? No. I have to do it tomorrow. Yeah, I haven't no. done it yet. Then, speaking of Halloween, block Halloween. That's cute. Look Isn't at the little. Great? Is that a witch's boot? It is. Yeah, dive on in there. Some pumpkins. I see a broom. Little candy corn. Look at look at <gasps> the look at the boo coming off of this pumpkin. I can't. This is boo. adorable. Boo. And you'll get it in time for Halloween. I know. Oh, that's. Who wants to take the kids trick or treating or hand out the candy mm -hmm. in that or wear it to work? This is adorable. Oh no, I'm thinking if I only had a brain. This is what we're calling light navy scarecrow. Look at the little hashing in his jeans, the straw coming out of the bottom of his jeans, the the um, the fence, the corn growing in the background. He's just waiting for a fun little crow to come and just have a little conversation. I'm waiting for Toto to kind of go uh -huh. running across the front. And our final option is the chambray barn. This oh. was the new one this season, and we just have a handful left. Wow. Uh, just that's so you great. know. But look at the detail in the barn itself, the horse, the tractor, the pumpkins there, the windmill, and uh, this. Silo, Silo thank Silo. you. Andre was wait. She knew I was. She knew. To get She's that on right. the ball. My extra friend, know me or what? <laughs> extra, extra small through three X. You get pockets. It's semi fit. Do you want to walk over and see it on the body? Yeah, to absolutely. To see it on Andre, we'll bring a few colors with us. All right, thank you. Uh huh. You got it. All right, yep. and we've got our we've got our little yep, scarecrow yep, yep. over there. Andrea five ten in the large. This is adorable. Yep. This is favorite season. Like, do you not see the leaves changing? Do you not hear yes. the crunch of the leaves below your feet? Yes. That's what this top's all about. Yeah, the stink bugs trying to get inside. You know, I was trying to be celebratory. I found a stink bug on our upstairs curtain the other night. Just kind of stared at it. Like, I don't want to touch you, but I don't want you here. Yeah. What do we do? Yeah. <laughs> Delightful. <laughs> yes, but no, I love the celebratory stuff too. I've been noticing the leaf starting to change yeah. just a little bit. Driving by, we have a, a farmer's market near us and they had all the pumpkins on display. Mm. The mums, I did pick up two things of mums. Oh, I haven't done that yet. I did do that, but I decorate for Halloween. All my Halloween decorations are done. Okay. I made sure it got finished yesterday mm -hmm. and then I do harvest November 1st. I know I'm oh, crazy See, I like do that, harvest. I'm going to throw in a little happy Halloween sign and a couple of pumpkins on, on nice. Tuesday for the 1st, but I do have my fall decorations done. All this embroidery, nice and soft. You guys use really silky thread so it feels good against the body. I like a little length. You can do this if you want. Mm -hmm. It's just a hair, hair longer in the back, mm -hmm. like a hair. It's just such a cute top. And if this is your season, or if you know someone whose season it is, if you know someone who has that fall birthday, maybe are you hosting Thanksgiving? This could be a great top to wear. Absolutely. Any of these, I think, really work. Absolutely, yes. We have the light navy and the scarecrow. Mm -hmm. I'm holding on to the chambray barn, which we got married in a refurbished barn, so the barn has a special place in my oh, heart. Fun. I have to share that. Then we have the espresso corn, and I see the black Halloween. Item numbers A292691. Six easy payments go away at the end of the day. It's fun, it's celebratory, it's comfortable. It's like a light, light, lightweight sweatshirt. And it's a lightweight French terry. Yes, it is. Yes. While you're placing <clears throat> your order, Isla's been very patient on the phone calling from Florida. Isla, how are you? It's Andrea and Angel and Katie. Nice to see you. Hi. Listen, I love Quacker Factory. I was there when Jean Dice first brought off the brand. Uh, brand. Angel is excellent uh, carrying the baton on. I like three things. First of all, Jean recognized that those of us who are heavy, regardless of whether we are uh, small or larger, we like to sparkle and shine, too. Yeah. Yep. Then the second thing I like is the whimsy, the celebration of the seasons and the holidays. 
And the third thing I, li- I like is when I raise my arms, you don't see my midsection gotcha. on these. And I think nice. that's so important. And those dream jeans, I just wish I could afford more. I like the two shirts for a certain price because I'm a retiree, and that's certainly uh, economically stable for me. Yes. So Absolutely. keep on designing, keep on realizing that women who have some figure, uh, some little, a little meat on them, like whimsy and, and sparkles too. Absolutely. And thank you, Angel, and thank you, ma'am. Uh, oh thank goodness, you, Isla. That thank was you. that was great. Thank I love you. how you just kind of shared thank it you. all. You know what you like. Thank you so much. And I love that you called to share it with us. Thank you for that. Have a wonderful Sunday. You too. Good night. Okay. Good night, good night. Isla. That's a woman who knows what she likes. Uh, yeah, gets right to the and point. And you know what? I, like I love the appreciation. And I think that that is why we have so many Quacker customers who've been with us since Jean yeah, started. Absolutely. Continue today and, and will continue this on for some time to come. Absolutely. That's awesome. Yeah. So we have the Scarecrow and the Late Nevi. Again, I'm, you know you're singing some Wizard of Oz with me. Chambray, ba- oh, Chambray Barn is, is gone. Mm-hmm. Congratulations. But we still uh, have the espresso corn. Yep. Black Halloween. No, I love this. Boo. <laughs> Two weeks in a row. <laughs> Nailed it. They're uh, Andrea's it, shoes, by the way. Shoe. Her witch shoes. Oh, oh. <laughs> Where do we get a pair of those? Hey, <laughs> 292 You have to be a witch. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we all have our moments. Come on. Come on. I actually, uh, I have a great coconut broom from Roxanne De Palma that I bought a couple years ago, and oh, I saw yeah. it hanging in the garage the other day. I was like, I 